You know, the, the Wheaties deal uh, came about, we signed with them last year around May. Uh, then a couple, three, four months ago, they came to us with this Wheaties Next Challenge. And uh, it was myself and four other athletes that are competing. Uh, some soccer, some running, a UFC guy. So we're currently in second place. And uh, we definitely need you guys to log in your workouts on Map My Fitness. Um, and more of the deal, you can go to mapmyfitness.com sign up, uh, log in, username and everything, you can accept the Wheaties Next Challenge and then uh, basically every 30 minutes you work out, you get to cast a vote up to two times a day. So that's the main deal. You know, I uh, really could use your guys' help right now. We're a little bit behind, but uh, long, about 50 days left to go. So I'm logging all my stuff on there um, for my, my, my uh, biking, uh, my uh, weights and all my riding as well. So even today, race day. So trying to uh, get up there but uh, we we really appreciate you guys and um, the help and uh, I mean not just for me but for the sport of motocross as well and hopefully we can get on that Wheaties box. You know with this Wheaties deal it's definitely cool to, to be aligned with uh, great uh, you know non-endemic sponsors like them you know and I've been very fortunate with my career and a lot of other guys too but uh, this this Wheaties deal is, is a great opportunity you know I it's a long ways to go yet but uh, to get on that box would be a dream come true and, and really good for the sport you know not not only um, I mean, the best have been on from Jordan, Michael Jordan to uh, Sean White. I mean, you name them, Olympic athletes, uh, all-star athletes, football, basketball, everybody. So, you know, to put your name on that, to be the first motocross guy on it would be uh, would be amazing. And, uh, I mean, I just uh, hope we can pull it off. And I believe in everybody, and we got a strong community. These fans are very committed and loyal, and, uh, you know, they're, they're there. They've been, all, they've been there for me my whole career, and I couldn't thank them enough. So uh, this, this is... Uh, one thing I can't, I won't, uh, I can't thank them enough either. So, you know, we got them out to Minneapolis in 2013, which uh, was an awesome race. You know, we were able to run down the leader and, and make get the win. And I think for them to be able to see the energy, I mean, the excitement of the crowd, how like dedicated our fans are to our sport, and uh, you know, for them to come and see that, I think it was an awesome opportunity. And and uh, maybe maybe the decision that uh, we want to align with uh, with with the guy in motocross and, and myself. So. Um, it's been awesome working with them. You know, they, it's kind of out of their comfort zone maybe a little bit, but, you know, they, they took a step, a, a leap of faith with me, and, um, you know, and I, and I enjoy it. The ride's been awesome. It's been a year now, so uh, hopefully we can continue that for a while. You know, I've always, as a kid, wanted to, to be partnered with um, outside non-endemic sponsors, you know, the elite of the elite. Um, you know, early in my career, Nike was there, Target came along, which was, uh, which was huge. And then, uh, you know, guys like Skull Candy, now we're with Wheaties, Sony, um, you know, being able to run that Nike boot a couple years ago, you know, they're no longer with us anymore in the sport, but uh, that was amazing and, and really cool to be able to run the boot. Um, but, uh, you know, I've always wanted to be good to the sport and I've always hopefully, you know, maybe maybe one day them sponsors can get involved in our in our sport more and uh, on a... Uh, more of a you know serious base of sponsoring the outdoor circuit or supercross and stuff like that it's uh, a lot of money for that stuff but um you know i a goal of mine i've always wanted to leave this sport better than than i came in you know uh, that meaning um when i came in if, if it wasn't that if if i could make it a little bit better bringing in outside help that would uh that'd make me happy i mean it's given me a career and uh a great you know life and um a lot of fun things along the way and, and uh, enjoyment so uh um, you know, I'd really be cool to uh, make the sport better, and hopefully, when I leave, you know, uh, it just keeps growing. So that that that's the that's the goal of mine too.